Good morning from the beach today. Hope you're having a great day. I want to talk to you about a possible goal hack that you might want to consider for yourself. Anybody who knows me knows that I've been really big into setting and reaching goals my whole life. And I've missed more than I've reached, I'll tell you that. It's really important though that you have a goal that is reachable, but also a stretch, right? You wanna make sure it's a stretch goal, so it's above and beyond what you think you can do, so that you can actually stretch yourself to get there. Now, one of the hacks is this. You've gotta have yourself being reminded of that goal every minute of every day. When I say every minute, I mean constantly. I mean all the time. I mean repeatedly. I mean incessantly. I mean continually. I mean all the time. Am I making my point? It absolutely has to be every single moment of the day. You have to be thinking about that in the back of your mind. It doesn't be the forefront, but it has to be in the back of your mind all the time. How do you do that? How do you keep it in front of you? Something very funny happened this week that I want to tell you about. Amber um, set up one of our passwords for one of our financial uh, institutions. We have a brand new controller for our company and I was teaching her, I was doing a screen share and I was showing her our passwords for some of our, ba our bank accounts. And one of them was very focused. It had three words, I'm not gonna tell you, but it had three words that were designed around living how we live now on the ocean. And those three words were followed by the date 2023. So I was showing her this, I was showing our controller this new password. And as I said it out loud, I laugh because I, you know how your computer remembers passwords so you don't see them all the time? Well, I hadn't put this one in for a long time. But as I looked at it, I said 2023. I go, oh my gosh. I called Amber. I said, honey, look at your password. She goes, I know. The goal was to be in Florida on the beach in 2023, yet we moved here in 2021. Two years ahead of schedule. But it was in her password all the time. So I have my password set up to have goals that I'm achieving at the time. And that's what I keep them at. So I would encourage you to try a little hack like that. Keep something that you have to put in your computer, like your computer password. That's something you use just to type in every time you sit down at your computer. And if you don't, set that up. So every time you sit down, you're typing in your goal. That way it's in your brain all the time. You may not think about it consciously, but you're thinking about it subconsciously constantly. And the more you think about it, the more everything seems to line up in your world to get you to that goal. So it's a simple hack. It's one that most people really overlook. So number one, set the goal up. Make sure the goal is a stretch goal, because you don't want to say, listen, my goal is to take four steps this morning. Yay, I reached it. That's a horrible goal. You want to have a goal that's a stretch goal that pushes you out of your comfort zone a little bit, but it's something that you can actually reach. Then make sure that you have everything in your life designed so that you can actually think about it and be reminded about it continuously. If it's not just passwords, have pictures around. Have things written down, amber in her mirror. I think she has uh, love and joy and laughter. Like, oh, choose love, joy, and laughter. She put that in the mirror here about six months ago, or six weeks ago. And I see it and it's made a big difference in how she's raising her kids and even talking to me. So it's pretty cool that she has those things to remind her all the time. So take that hack, put things around your house, put things around your world, change your passwords to be things that will remind you of what you're going for so you never ever forget because those long-term goals are the toughest ones to get and the ones you have to stay on the course for the longest. Hope that helps. A ton of opportunity out there today and a ton of opportunity today. Go out there and enjoy yours. All of my family and friends who are in the Northeast, in case you're wondering, that bright thing right there, that's the sun. You probably haven't seen that in a few weeks. Love you guys. See ya.